Hi there and welcome back to the culture. Construction complete. Culture loves you instantly and uh, yeah, we have a lot to do here. Especially we want to <laughs> we want to have a good fleet coming. So we have made a resolution to build three corvettes each year. At least that. The culture is pretty peaceful, but this guy, Elothas Miomel, our leader, our current first speaker, has a corvette focus and is warlike. He has a personal collection of sports corvettes and uh, yeah, he just he just wants them out there. It's something he likes. He's also upgrading the fleet, something that has hasn't been done in a long time. Construction complete. He also considers it worthwhile to upgrade them, instead of going for just buildings. So, we're building corvettes now, of the Torpedo class. Supposedly three each year should suffice, at least that's what the parliament means. I mean, he would, he would build a lot more, because he has reserved for himself the right to test fly these these bad boys and uh, Ships it's incredibly fun look at that yeah we're growing into the into the realms of 10k fleet whoa we're so good we're so good the prime sea Prime C still needs things to do. Oni Master, why aren't you on the Prime C? We have seen you there. That's crazy. Well, now you're there. Yeah, he's he's as a personal project. And has, a, has an up-leveling point, he has the Prime C reserved for himself. While the old Xirolako is just wandering around, issuing plans everywhere and... ...upgrading stuff, uh, as he says it. We soon have full energy credits, that's crazy. Hmm. Now that, that could be something to... Oh my god, the Xolpi declared war on the scientific directorate. Did we have a defensive pact with them? No. But who has got the defensive pact? The Lunarians and the Changer... The Lunarians are totally without a fleet at the moment. Ah. <sighs> anyone protecting them if not they're done right I think they're done it was fun knowing you but we cannot help you at the moment against the Xolpes <laughs> they're just too strong yeah we want to adjust the sectors and that's what we want And we don't need energy credits anymore from you. And you can get some from us. And in turn this also means we can go form even more of the glorious synths once we have the minerals. That is... Hey, as cool as ice. Hey, these... These guys are wandering to Nafdigo, wherever that is. We can also change our food storage now, so we don't have that massive uh, growth. And have some kind of stockpile to go back on. We'll, we'll make it a large one. Large food stockpile. So we can trade better with it too.
Yeah, that's the changes you would like. Robo jungle. Doing well. Let's let's go for the Alps. Again. Upgrade the things we have here. Minerals. Good to upgrade. Hmm. Yeah, in time we're we're also building our fleet, like Corvettes. We we want to build Corvettes because he's a big Corvette fan, as I already said. Now we have impulse thrusters. That is very good. These highly advanced fusion-powered thrusters provide ships with unmatched maneuverability and speed under supply conditions. Which means we can upgrade a lot of stuff. And uh, hmm, the railgun is something we really want. But Dura Steel Materials is much more applicable to everything, and we really, we really want, we want that. We want that too, though. More minerals. It's a toss-up. Dura Steel Materials don't come up that often, so we'll go for the Dura Steel Armor for now. Should be okay. Hey, tough Sophia, what are you doing? Why are not you? Why aren't you in the ship? A scandal. I want you in that ship? I've been doing nothing all that time. What a waste! Let's see. Already doing better, right? Doing good. Research is on again. Thanks, Sophia. How about some upgrades to the tomb? Hmm, engineering? Still? Still engineering. Yeah, it's going well again with these upgrades and stuff. Can go for a lot of storage. Oh, look at that. Communications established. We are receiving a transmission from the independent space station of the Xura Corp. They appear to have successfully translated our language. Very interesting. Who are you? We are a business conglomerate operating out of the Manthal system, specializing in the trade of minerals and energy, the very building blocks of civilization, as we like to say here at Xura Corp. Please do not hesitate to contact us if you're interested in making a good deal. Well met. But we're still building up, guys. We're still building up. You should know that. We're in the early stages of our civilization. Yet. Especially Corvettes. Hey, come on. We should upgrade the Corvettes. Now. And the destroyers. Two. Guten Morgen, Herr Pape. Uh, nein, Moment. Falsch. <laughs> Guten Morgen, Frau Hermann. Walter Hermann. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I just got a call. So, I uh, don't mind if, if uh, the music is changed. <laughs> Yeah, just got a call, so I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, well, um, yeah, we have reformed now that totally damage class thing to a more speedy variant, which is, I think, pretty good. Like removing these shields quickly has always been very helpful in confrontations so let's see that we can improve that in the future could upgrade these ones oh have I not saved this now 
I have, haven't I? Well, that's odd. <laughs> well, we could upgrade these ones. For 15, I think that's okay. There we go. Space oh, yeah. Totally damaged class. What did we want to have here? Yeah, the Corvettes with a higher combat speed now. That's what we wanted. And really, we should also get afterburners here. Just makes much more sense. 50, yeah, that's okay. And 90. If stuff makes more sense, then it will all be good. How are these doing? Mm, we could, in turn, we could really... I think we should change that thing. I think it would make sense to change it into a mining network. Or what do we have? We have... Yeah, we have a mineral processing plant, so that makes sense. So let's change that and we can upgrade this farm here. That's okay to, to have that here. I mean, 2 plus is something not easily ignored. Look at that. We have good 10,000 now. And that's very helpful. Now, how is it going? Out there. On Schlargos. How are you doing, guys? In your industrial age? Will you conform? What? It was reset. Go to the infiltration again. It was really reset. Come on. <laughs> and we need more from Robo Jungle. resistance yeah I'm sorry I'm just checking that through I don't know I'm not sure yeah well two is hard to ignore as I already said and now prime C we have him here that should work with him This is what we want first, then uh, we want something else here. Another mining network. And we could instantly go for another energy producing building here. Maybe the energy grid already. I think that should be fine. In the long, long run we'll profit from that as um, we'll need the energy. Oh, Swaby Protectorate. Proctorate, I mean. Can we give you something? We would give you as many energy credits as, as you'd like. I'll give you 1001 energy credits. think you can need it. Are you at war already? I think they were at war. They're not anymore if, if they were. That's good. Uh, they liked it. That's what we love. Schlargos. Let's do it again. Can we do here? Uh, no covert infiltration, no indoctrination. 
It's just not good. Look at that. They have integrated that now. So the Dreadnought will go in, in time. <gasps> There's a Spectre again. Where is it? It's in Scat. Ah, oh, it will destroy our space stations. No! Oh, it didn't. Well, thankfully. <laughs> yeah, go over to the Hanash Dam. Terrorize them, Spectre. How is that going? Hmm. Not that good. How could we gain more power? Empire population. Hmm. We're too big for them to... What? <laughs> Demand tribute? No. But invite them to be our vessel, but they don't want, it seems. Now, how is... Yeah, we have room for a lot more corvettes, so we should build more corvettes with a with the minerals we have. Let's just build a bunch of corvettes, a real bunch. That's what our leader, our glorious leader likes <laughs> to see. <laughs> Talakur. Mm, yeah, good things coming to us. Maybe we should correct that. At least that, I mean. Yeah, because it doesn't get multiplied. We should replace that with something. Uh, could be anything. Clone vats. I think we have the Frontier Clinic. Do we have that? It's a home planet though. So I think we cannot do it here. Because it's their home. Oh no, we have it here already. The Frontier Clinic. Ah, uh, yeah, we could go for the clone vats. These guys are strong. So we could clone them. On the other hand, just go basic science, right? There we go. And then maybe upgrade the hospital. Don't need that much food at the moment, so we'll put you here. Nice. That should be enough. Then these guys on the Archivist Embassy. Now, mm. oh, Xicholaco will be our oldest, <laughs> oldest guy out there. Plus two is nothing to joke. Plus two cannot be ignored. <laughs> Alps. The Alps need uh, more minerals too. And the tomb. There can't be done much on the tomb, right? But Robo Jungle as well, wow, now it's going crazy. Now we have new offers. <laughs> Let's see if they can offer something besides energy. Oh, no. Not really. We don't need your energy, guys. We'd rather keep our stuff. 
Cannot get rid of the energy at the moment. So it is as it is. <laughs> How's the leaders tab going? Ah, we're we're preparing for another leader, so we could hire one to if we had a good one, that is. Slugradeb the scientist. The Igor Talakur. <laughs> Yeah, that would be nice too, right? But M1D? Why not? I mean, it's the best choice we have at the moment. <laughs> Let's just recruit him. Put him into a science ship on, I don't know, friendship system. The Christunan embassy, maybe. They haven't removed the noxious swamp yet. It's crazy. Anyways, you can help. Help these guys. Just upgrade the fleet. <laughs> to the latest designs. And now... Assist the research. Construction complete. Resistance also needs some upgrades. We can build so many ships now, it's not funny. <laughs> and we'll really do that. There's no question. How about our traditions, though? Can we go for the courier network soon? Very soon, in two months. That will be great to have. We'll finish that, we'll go for the courier network. And a, oh, Ascension perks too. And that's so exciting. <laughs> I have to think about what Ascension perk to take next. <laughs> uh, Robo Jungle is all good there. All right. And they want to give us energy credits. Enough talk. <laughs> You have a pretty big food storage, I've got to say. Now everything's happening at once, again. Ascension theory, traditions available, Ascension perk available. Let's have a look, what do we have? We could go evolutionary mastery now. Which is what we wanted. We could also go voidborn, which is also what we wanted. I'll, I'll have to decide. I think maybe... Maybe we could go Voidborn first. As we're starting to get a lot of minerals now. And that might work. To... Further increase our population and our power. And then we have to think about... Will we go for a new life? Probably not yet. Probably rather a courier network. Reach for the stars and galactic ambitions is pretty good later on. But not yet. So we'll see ourselves also new technology to choose in the next episode with a quite a, a number of decisions to be made. Thank you for watching. Happy gaming to you. The culture loves you. <laughs>